Hi and welcome in a new lesson of JavaScript tutorial. Like what we've explained in the last two lessons, how to access to an element and change its value and style. In this lesson, we will learn how to make an action. Like what will happen when a user click the mouse or when an image has been loaded. All this called events. So let me see what meant by events and how we can make it. So in this lesson, I will explain mouse events like on click, on mouse over, on double click, on mouse out. So let's start by the most common event, which is on click. Let me create an image and make two buttons, one to hide this image and another one to uh, show it again. So let me create an image and give it an ID equal to ing and src equal to two dot jpg and uh, let me give it a width equal to 200 now let me create the hide button and the show button so button and let me give it an id equal to this one is hide and call hide the image now let me make another one which you called show so now I want to make two events one for the hide button to hide the image and another one for the show button to show the image again so firstly let me define variables to access to the image and uh, the buttons so the first one called image and equal to document that get element by id how do we make another one for the hide image or hide button and its id is hide and this one show and its id is show so let me see now how we can make this event which is on click so for the first one hide and then the name of the event so the event called on click when we click uh, this button what will happen a function and inside this function we can make anything we can alert a message we can uh, change a style or change uh, the content for an element so we want to hide the image how we can hide the image right we will change the style display to be none so image dot style dot display equal to none nice I'll let me make another event for uh, the show button so this one called show and to be display block so hide show hide and show nice and also instead of on click we can make it double click so when we click twice so let me try so hide the image if i click just one click nothing will happen but twice the image will be shown up now let me make a text to explain how we can use on mouse over and on mouse out events so here let me create a heading h3 and give it an id equal to text and call it for example mouse over and here let me define a variable 
whole text. So for the text, let we make an event on mouse over. This means when the mouse hover the text, what will happen? I want to change uh, the text to be anything else. So text dot on mouse over equal to a function. So we want to change the content of the heading. So we will access to the heading which has a variable text dot in our HTML equal to for example let we type anything oops for example so when we now hover the text it will be changed to be oops but I wanted to change it back so when the mouse leave the text it will be the same so let we make an event another event to return it back so the same thing but the event will be on mouse out so on mouse out we want the text be the same thing like before which is mouse over let me try so mouse over oops leave mouse over again nice so those are the mouse events there are another events like on load on focus on input and a lot more in the next lesson i will explain some other events so practice the events that we explained in this video and try to make something by yourself so good luck and see you next time